This video is brought to you by Captivating History. Historians once believed in the so-called great man theory. They believed that certain men, and it was always men in those days, determined the most important historical developments through their remarkable skills and capabilities. The individuals in question were usually kings, generals, popes, and other leaders. Today, we know better. First, and perhaps most important, we realize that people of all genders played a crucial role in making and remaking the world of the past. Second, not only leaders and politicians matter. The so-called regular people make up most of society and often lead social and political trends which leaders must follow to remain in power. Ultimately, the most important historical trends result from geographic, economic, and deep social processes. Nonetheless, some people have had a crucial role in the development of our world. Here is a list of the most important amongst them. Confucius The philosophy of Confucianism has been a dominant stream in Chinese culture for 2,500 years. Indeed, more than anything else, it is the most foundational element uniting China throughout its various incarnations. The ethical philosophy espoused by Confucius has shaped the traditional approach to family, governance, and law which has transcended the centuries. In addition, his teachings have inspired millions outside China to lead more ethical lives. Aristotle The importance of Aristotle is hard to overstate. His philosophical theories encompassed all fields of human and natural endeavors, from politics to medicine. In all of those fields, his approach was dominant for over two millennia. While most of his theories have been disregarded or disproven, Advances in every conceivable area are built on the dialogue of future generations with the Greek godfather of rational thought. Alexander the Great Alexander died at age 32, but left the world of antiquity transformed. His stunning military conquests spread from Macedonia to India as he eviscerated all that stood before him. In the process of his military achievements, Alexander altered the culture of the Near East and the entire Mediterranean. He left behind him a world dominated by Greek culture and aesthetics. As a student of Aristotle, it is only fitting that he served as the ultimate vehicle for spreading Greek philosophy. Cicero The Roman philosopher was inspired by Greek philosophy and oratory, which was considered entirely superior. His most crucial life work was to establish a Latin culture of substance. In his translations of Greek texts, he reinvigorated the Latin language and brought oratory to new heights. In his spare time, Cicero fought tirelessly to defend the Roman Republic. Galileo Galileo was the first astronomer in the modern sense. Through telescopic observation and solid theoretical underpinnings, he developed theories of the working of heavenly bodies, which were purely secular. By building on the previous work of Nicholas Copernicus, he helped prove the world revolved around the sun. By doing so, he negated church doctrine, which held that our planet was at the center of the universe. Leonardo da Vinci The term Renaissance man, or more appropriately person, has come to mean an individual with a facility in many seemingly unrelated disciplines. Da Vinci is, alongside Michelangelo, the shining example of this trope. His most famous work, the Mona Lisa, is one of the biggest tourist attractions on Earth. However, his notebooks reveal that Leonardo was also a master inventor and visionary. Johann Gutenberg In 1450, Gutenberg created the first operational commercial printing press. The invention allowed the dissemination of information speedily and efficiently. Beforehand, texts had to be slavishly copied over extended periods. It is hard to imagine modern history without books the press, and the printing press's grandchildren, the computer, and social media. William Shakespeare Widely regarded as the finest playwright in any language, the legacy of William Shakespeare far transcends the theater. His plays and sonnets reinvented modern English and helped grant it the coherence and depth needed to become the global lingua franca. However, most importantly, his nuanced characters are credited with putting the individual at the forefront of Western culture. Isaac Newton Gravity has always existed, but we did not understand its full significance until the development of Newtonian physics. 
he developed a fully coherent set of laws of motion, which revolutionized physics and facilitated a wave of innovations based on his approach. Aside from gravity, Newton's brilliant mind gave us calculus, so that you can credit or blame him for that as well. Martin Luther Luther was one of many critics of Catholic Church corruption in his day. However, the combination of diffusion of power in post-feudal Germany and the power of his critiques splintered Christianity and altered Europe forever. It also sowed the seeds for the Puritan movement behind the United States. In addition, the emergent Protestant philosophy allowed a new, more pluralistic continent to emerge in its wake. Voltaire The philosophy of Voltaire saw the crafting of a secular alternative to Christian dogma. He championed the separation of church and state and freedom from religion, the cornerstones of modern liberal democracies. Thomas Jefferson No one represents the complexity and duality of the United States more than Jefferson. The Declaration of Independence codifies the grandest aspirations of the country to equality and freedom. The text has inspired millions to oppose repressions worldwide. Yet his unwillingness to fight slavery and his conduct of buying and abusing slaves reflects the inability of the U.S. to live up to its ideals. Adam Smith Our lives today are governed by the logic and ideology of capitalism. Smith believed that if governments stood out of the way and allowed individuals to generate economic activity, the result would entail great prosperity. While capitalism has its share of problems, the intertwined globalized economy would be unthinkable without Smith's book, Wealth of Nations. Queen Victoria This remarkable sovereign ruled for such a long and momentous period that an entire epoch of history and culture has been named after her. In the Victorian era, she oversaw world-changing processes such as industrialization and the emergence of the Second British Empire. Yet, all the while, she encouraged a morally repressive set of values, which has since been named after her. Mohandas Gandhi In more than one way, Gandhi's anti-colonial struggle against the British Empire left a lasting positive legacy for humanity. He preached the dignity of oppressed people under colonial domination. But his most outstanding contribution was the spread of an ideology of nonviolent resistance. It has inspired great leaders such as Martin Luther King and Nelson Mandela while keeping alive the dream that justice may be achieved without undue bloodshed. Rosalind Franklin Franklin was a pioneering chemist of such great importance that it is hard to isolate one achievement. However, her contribution to DNA analysis by discovering the double helix is the most influential. Without her pioneering work, DNA sequencing and X-ray crystallography would not be possible. And she did all this in an era wherein science was incredibly unfriendly to women. Adolf Hitler No one said the most influential people had to leave a positive legacy on the world. Yet, more than anyone else, Hitler was the driving force behind the most destructive conflict in world history and some of the worst atrocities committed by humankind. However, there is also a silver lining. After all, the vast majority of the world ultimately united against and defeated Nazi Germany. Toussaint Louverture The general was born a slave in Haiti, but refused to accept his unjust fate or the fate of his home island. Against all odds, he led a revolution against colonialism and slavery. He died in a French jail, but the embers of rebellion he stoked burst into full flame. A year after his death, Haiti declared independence. The successful struggle of the Haitian people would inspire millions worldwide to fight against injustice. Simon Bolivar In the early 19th century, all of what we today call Latin America was under colonial domination. Born into the Spanish Empire in what is today Venezuela, Simon was inspired by the principles of the French Revolution to lead a rebellion against Spain. In 1819, he founded and led Gran Colombia, the first independent country in South America. Today, Venezuela, Bolivia, Colombia, Ecuador, Peru, and Panama consider him their national hero. Napoleon Bonaparte Napoleon may have been the greatest general who ever lived. However, his most significant contributions can be found elsewhere. As Emperor of France, Napoleon crafted and codified a legal system that remains the basis of continental jurisprudence. But most importantly, 
he rose to become the most powerful person in the world by his impressive capabilities rather than birth. As such, the ascendancy to power signaled the waning of the principle of divine inherited monarchy and the rise of a society based on meritocracy. Charles Darwin The English naturalist was the first to develop a scientifically testable explanation for humanity and all other living organisms. He brought the terms evolution, natural selection, and survival of the fittest into common parlance. At the time, his opinions gained notoriety for their incongruity with some popular religious explanations for the creation of life. However, today what is most remarkable is how many of his ideas remain cornerstones of our approach to biology. Karl Marx The German philosopher is best known for the political ideology which carries his name. Marxism inspired countless successful and unsuccessful revolutions worldwide. His theories were taught as scientific facts in the USSR, China, and elsewhere. Although his approach has ultimately failed, it opened our eyes to the dangers of economic inequality and the need to ameliorate them in the name of stability and justice. Jane Addams Addams won the 1919 Nobel Peace Prize for her work as a social worker and feminist. Her work to improve the conditions of poverty and fight social inequality was exemplified by the settlement houses she established. Among the causes she advocated for successfully were literacy and poverty elimination. Her practical efforts at grassroots organizing for social justice are more relevant today than ever. Sigmund Freud Freud's theories of childhood sexuality were highly controversial at the time and remain so today. However, even those who disagree with tenets of psychoanalysis use his well-developed vernacular of human motivation. His insight, recounted in Freud's voluminous works and effective practice, that we often act based on unconscious motives has revolutionized our understanding of human actions. Marie Curie Marie Curie and her husband Pierre did not discover radiation. However, they rendered it applicable and beneficial to society by isolating polonium and radium. The development of life-saving measures such as X-ray examinations and cancer treatment through radiation therapy. Mao Zedong Chairman Mao has a mixed legacy of atrocities and successful nation-building. The Great Leap Forward and Cultural Revolution were unsuccessful attempts to alter Chinese society and remove its traditional underpinnings. However, after years of disunity, Mao's ability to unite China under one government and ideology changed global history. J. Robert Oppenheimer Most professors from Berkeley want to change the world, but Oppenheimer did so. He oversaw the Manhattan Project, which resulted in the first operable atomic bomb. However, the professor had some serious doubts about the era of nuclear terror the bomb had ushered in. As it went off, he recalled the quote, Now I am become death, the destroyer of worlds, from Hindu script. Eleanor Roosevelt Roosevelt was a crucial advocate for African Americans and women's rights. However, her most important legacy was the drafting of the Universal Declaration of Human Rights. It remains a beacon of the aspiration to dignify all human existence. Rosa Parks Rosa is most famous for her act of defiance to a system of racism and injustice. On December 1, 1955, she boarded a segregated bus in Montgomery, Alabama. She shocked the white driver and passengers by refusing to sit in the back of the bus. Thus began the Montgomery Bus Boycott, a landmark in the successful fight against Jim Crow laws in the United States. Mark Zuckerberg The press that the founder of Facebook receives is not particularly positive. However, the importance of his pioneering approach to social media cannot be ignored. Today, billions globally communicate through the network he established. Facebook has also completely transformed the modern era of politics and allowed the spread of disinformation to an extent previously unimaginable. We hope you liked this video on the top 30 most influential people in history. If you did, please hit the like button and subscribe for more videos like this. Also, grab your free Mythology Bundle ebook while it's still available. The link is in the description.